The Finger Post Public House, formerly known as the Royal Oak, appears to harbour a rather sinister presence, which has been experienced by a previous landlord and his dog. Since becoming the Finger Post, paranormal activity has continued and on one occasion focused its attention on the chef. Back in 2001, I wrote about the haunting of the Royal Oak Public House, now known as the Finger Post. The Royal Oak Public House was established in 1818 and was owned and run by the York and the Wilner family for nearly a hundred years. Although no one has ever seen a ghost at the Royal Oak, as far as I'm aware, this public house certainly harbours a foreboding presence. I was told by the late Mike Hughes, pub manager in 2001, that periodically and for no apparent reason there is a terrifically foreboding atmosphere in this establishment which builds up to the point where those present anticipate something will happen. From what I was told the activity around this pub seems very much to be poltergeist activity. Mike told me that periodically, and for no apparent reason, the music centre and gas bottles would turn off by themselves, and following this, lights would start flickering despite having been in perfect working order all day. Both the electrical supply and gas bottles are kept in the cellar, meaning that Mike had to go down there each time this happened to check for problems and to reset supplies. During this time of unrest, Mike told me that the temperature plummets almost immediately, particularly in the cellar when it becomes icy cold. He also described to me a strange atmosphere of cold spots present all around, which he said could be very unnerving, particularly when he felt like he was being surrounded. Mike was not the only one to have experienced strange phenomenon at the Royal Oak. His dog too sometimes felt a presence which caused him to become fraught. He had been seen viciously barking at thin air and frantically scratching at the floor. Unlike other haunted pubs in Pelsall I have researched, I have been unable to ascertain why the finger post experiences such poltergeist activity. Shortly after becoming the finger post, I was told that the chef at the time started to be plagued by tapping at the window as if someone was trying to attract his attention. The chef continued to ignore the tapping as it was impossible for someone to be standing outside of this particular window as there was a ten-foot drop beneath. However, on this occasion the present saw fit to throw a loaf of bread at the chef to make sure that it had his attention. If you have ever experienced paranormal activity at the finger post, please let me know.